Today we're going to do the final part of our Glow M video training series. We're going to compare Glow M with the regular Glow, which I will also often refer as Glow Bovine. So let's do the comparison between the two. How do they differ? Number one, Glow M is from marine slash fish uh, source, so fish source, not shellfish, fish source, the skin of fish. Number two, the size of the peptide, peptides in the collagen hydrolysate. The Glow bovine contains peptide, collagen peptides, which have a molecular weight average of 5,000 Dalton. It does not contain any tripeptide. Glow M is made of collagen peptides, which have a molecular weight five times smaller, 1,000 Dalton, and contains 25% of tripeptide, those little sequence of three amino acids which are very absorbable. Number three, Glow M has three grams of collagen hydrolysate, where Glow Bovine has about 11 grams of the bovine collagen hydrolysate, so more in one than the other. Number four, Glow M has less calories than Glow Bovine. Personally, I'm always paying attention to uh, calories. Number five, which should have been in fact number four, was the fact that the Glow M has this 25% tripeptide, smaller molecular weight, therefore it's going to be better taken in, but, uh, much doesn't need to be digested as much, and way better uh, absorbed. Another thing, the taste. I like Glow M. Uh, global vibe, I'm having a little difficulty with the taste. So, and I know a few of you guys uh, are in this uh, situation. Glow M can go to foreign markets, international markets, because it is made from ingredients of suppliers who have worked with foreign government and registered their raw material and therefore it is much easier to go into international market. Uh, Glow bovine cannot go to international market due to its composition. Also, the level of biotin in Glow bovine is too high for, to go to any international market. That's why we decreased it to only 500 microgram so we can take it to every international market should we decide to do that should Trana decide to do that. Then Glow M is presented in stick packs, so much more convenient for transport. So that's a plus, you can put that in your purse or in your suitcase. And finally, and I think that's the biggest difference, I would say, is was the intent of the product. Glow M with its tripe collagen tripeptide, that apple extract from that apple that never aged, age it's more more as a beauty focus where glow uh, bovine with a higher level of collagen peptide and the l citrulline which is a precursor of l arginine which is a precursor of nitric oxide was more intended for workout and athletes. The focus of each product is a bit different, so that's a difference between those two, but that can also be a reason that you may want to combine, especially you may want to take the Glow uh, Bovine before your workout, as opposed to the rest of the week, you're taking your Glow M. So these are really the difference between those two products. So when is one used uh, better than the other one? What are the situation when you use one versus the other? Number one, if you are allergic to fish, then you will go for the glow bovine. If you are some, follow some religions or preferences, you don't want to consume a beef-based product, then you go with the marine fish one. So that's 
And another reason would be is if you want to have benefit specifically for a workout because of the presence of l citrulline uh, that amino acid which precursor of arginine precursor of NO nitric oxide then you would consume uh, more of the bovine these are the comparison between the two products they are both great and they are both addressing different uh, needs so i hope that helped you figure out what would you like to take thank you